This video covers the benefits of linking and how to update linked values. Data linking is a key component in maintaining data integrity and is a requirement for XBRL tagging. Note that creating data links is different from creating hyperlinks. Hyperlinks allow for cross-references in your documents, whereas data links establish a relationship among values that allows you to change your source value and have that update to multiple linked values. This greatly reduces the risk of errors in your document, as well as saves time. Let's take a look at updating a numeric value from your workbook. The principles of linking are the same for values in table cells and values in text. Values can be sourced from a workbook or from source links directly in a document. Here's a specific value in our table that we'll use as an example. If we select the cell and right-click, we can go to the Link Properties History panel. Now we can hover over the source link, and then here we'll click on the Go to Link icon. This brings up the workbook and highlights the source for the link that we were working with. Now I'll change this number in the workbook. Let's just change it to 800. So 281,800. Now you can see the indicator here that a change has been made in the cell. So this is the orange line next to the blue line indicating that this value and this document are now in draft. Now we'll go back to our document, and here you can see that same orange indicator next to the destination link triangle here in the upper left-hand corner. And you can see that the value has changed to 281,800. Also, there's an indicator here because the total has automatically changed. Once the document has been shared, then the draft indicators will disappear. Also note that all destination links have also been updated accordingly once we change that source link. This video has introduced the principles of linking.